<laughs> no. <laughs> I was just being a dick. Um, hi, everyone. So, um, here we are. Um, it's a Thursday evening, the 12th of August, and this is Kahal Challenge. Comfort Challenge. Kahal Comfort Challenge. Tōrima. Number five. And um, this challenge will span over a period of two days. And it's called a chocolate sandwich. I mean, <laughs> not a chocolate sandwich. <laughs> Phil's not even... <laughs> Phil's not even listening, I'm laughing to myself. Anyway, it's um, not a chocolate sandwich, it's a, oh, it's a criticism challenge. So that's the final challenge. Um, and uh, what it is, is um, over the next two days, at least once, I think it is, um, we have to, um, oh, what do we have to do? If there is someone that does something that you don't, um, that you don't agree with or that you don't like, um, then instead of avoiding the, the conflict or, um, Instead of ignoring it, Malo also. <laughs> Kia ora le hutai. My boy's asleep, otherwise, I would have given you a karanga. <laughs> um, anyway, um, so the, the whole point of Sap Taufa. I hope you enjoyed uh, Zumba. Kia ora, sis. Um, so I've been doing, um, I've jumped on the Kahal Comfort Challenges and today's the fifth one, um, the final challenge. And what it is was, um, it's called a criticism uh, sandwich. And um, basically we, this, this particular challenge will span over a period of two days. Um, and what happens, what we have to do or what I have to do is, once a day, um, I have to do something um, that resolves a conflict. So the example that was given was that if you are at, if you are in a place of mahi and one of your colleagues actually um, does something that you're not happy with, then rather than avoid hitting them up about it, um, or telling someone else, you actually sort it out yourself. Um, so, um, conflict doesn't really bother me. I mean, if someone's doing something that does not align with what, um, what I'm about, then um, I'm big on letting the person know. Um, because if people don't know, if you don't tell people, what they don't know, they don't know. So, but again, it's all in the delivery. And one thing I noticed today, and I did it, I actually just went into doing it without thinking about the challenge. Um, Phil and I were sitting, <laughs> sitting at the bank today. Um, and I was just sitting there and I turned to Phil and I said to him, you know, you're really, because out of the two of us, Phil has a lot more patience than I do. He, um, he's calm to my, he, he's the calm to my, to my storm, thunder and lightning. Um, so today we're sitting in the bank and I said to him, um, you know, be mindful that if you do start getting frustrated that you don't, um, Oh, actually, before I got into it, I actually said, you know, you're you're really good. You you when you have the conversation and when you share what you're wanting to achieve, and you're real cool and calm. Um, so I started off like that, and then um, I went into just be mindful if you do get frustrated um, that uh, 
you are mindful of your tone because sometimes you can be condescending um, and, and that can get the other person's back up. And then I ended it with, otherwise, just remain toe because you, you, you know, um, you can do this without getting frustrated because you're capable. So that was it. And that's basically what it is. It's like start off with acknowledging the good that they do, what they're good at, and then introduce what you don't agree with or you don't like, and then close the sandwich with, um, with reiterating what they are good at, you know, whether it be the same thing that you said at the beginning. Um, so we, I did that, and now Phil, when I was telling Phil about the challenge, see Phil does it all the time, he, he, he does this, that's just him, he, he just does that, he, he covers every situation in chocolate, um, which is probably why we've lasted 20 years, <laughs> um, <laughs> 20 years, anyway, uh, so yeah, so that was, that's the challenge, that's the final challenge um, for the next two days. And um, I didn't realise it was once, I only need to do it once a day. It's something that I've been trying to do, something I try and do ever since I hooked up with the Tane here, you know. Um, I tend to get a bit passionate though, eh? Mm -hmm. So kind of forget about the good thing <laughs> you could have done this better however so yeah so that's that's the challenge kahau i te ao challenge and then um submit this video and um and then wait to hear if i get the scholarship get one of the scholarships but you know what, like I said last night, um, even if I don't get uh, one of the scholarships, it's okay because these comfort challenges have, um, have served as uh, reminders. Um, they've also helped me bring stuff back with, you know, rather than be out, out there, you know, bring the focus back within. Um, and so, yeah, it, it, like I've tagged, there's a couple of you that I've tagged that I've actually sent Kahal the, the program to. Um, and it's because I see you guys doing your mahi, but your online presence is, um, you know, you may need help with, like myself. Eh? And so this course will benefit you in that way. Uh, and what they're doing is they're giving away scholarships. The gifting scholarships um, to Fano who are interested and to get in the running for a scholarship you have to go through and do five comfort challenges um, so like I said last night even though the comfort challenges have ended so to speak today um, the each challenge you're still doing them anyway um, like for instance today's challenge um, I have to you know it's a constant work in progress that's it that's that's one of the things I've noticed with these challenges is that um, even though you may think you're doing them already there's always room for improvement and it's not necessarily just with the challenges it's with anything now um, I think I, it was a couple of days ago um, talking about the eye gazing challenge right um and i got a message from one of my bros jay um earlier today and she was like her message was amazing um it was a voice message and uh, she basically said because i was talking about how with the eye gazing challenge i noticed that what i do is i do have eye contact but when i'm thinking about something like thinking more about what I'm saying and and having to you know pause what am I saying what do I need to say is that the right word I actually look away 
right? Well, it's actually a thing, bro. So um, she was having a conversation with one of her workmates and he turned around and told her that that's an actual thing. It's called a trans, hang on, trans the fuck, trans derivational search. That's what it is. Trans derivational search. You can look it up. Um, but yeah, it's, and I was saying to her, like, what I do when I do, well, I notice when I do look away, it's like um, pages of a book, but it's in my mind, right? And I'm scanning for the correct word or phrase. Um, yeah, that, that suits what I'm, well, that not necessarily suits, that will explain what I'm trying to deliver. So... Yes, Phil's yawning, but he's not yawning at what I'm saying. <laughs> um, what else is there? So, yeah. Learn something new every day. Anyway. Um, so, how'd your no challenge go? Did anyone try saying no? All day? Well, your next challenge, should you choose to accept it, is continue to say no. And... Make the most of your life, you know. Um, refine what you're doing. Refine where you're putting your energy to. Life is short, eh? Life is too short to be a bill payer. You're put on this earth, you know, to do more than just pay bills. You know, we are... Um, unique beings and uh, being stuck in um, in a situation which uh, does not bring you joy um, that's that person who cleans up their cupboards well anyway if you're doing something that does not bring you joy then um, yeah time to reflect on what is important uh, so yeah that's me Oh, I'll tell you what though, so um, the second time I tried doing the comfort, uh, what's it called? The criticism sandwich with Phil. Poor Phil, he had to put up with it today because we obviously were hanging to that together and we're on our way down to Wellington. And uh, I don't know how we got on the subject, but I ended up going for the critiquing first and then tried covering it up with the chocolate oh no no i i had the the sandwich the first the first part of it so i um i praised him for his great ideas and then i went into the criticism and then i was so caught up in the criticism that um i nearly forgot to close the sandwich so that's another thing with this challenge a eh, is that you're your sandwich filling doesn't have to be fucking a Big Mac kind of thing. It just needs to be a couple of slices of lettuce, but with a bit of depth of, 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 of your meat patty or ham, whatever it is. Did that make sense? Yeah. There's a few of you watching. Hi. Yeah, it is awesome. All righty, my darlings. That's me, again, way past my bedtime. Um, yeah. Jay, check out my earrings, babe. Thank you, Nanaya. These are her beauties. Um, yeah. I feel like there's something else, but there isn't. Um, have a have a look for that trans derivational search. Yeah. Anyway, Paul Marie, today is Thursday, tomorrow is Friday. Take care, be love, smile heaps, and even if you don't feel like smiling. Actually, if you don't feel like smiling, put on a germ and go crazy. Have a boogie. You know, 
it really really helps okay kakite po marie manuele po